The last day of our Ehime trip started with this warm Japanese breakfast at Furuiwayaso. So Norm got some coffee and look at how tiny that cup is. <laughs> and it's not espresso. No, it's not. Oh, it's not just not espresso. coffee. Just coffee. Two more sips and we're done. So this is our stuff. You're gonna get changed into this. We got a hat and a vest, kind of like jacket, and then these guys. And then we're gonna go to the temple. Even if you don't have anything for the pilgrimage, you can buy everything you need here. We drove from Furuiwayaso just for a few minutes, and now we are ready for Ohendo. There were surprising numbers of Ohendo-san besides us, even though today was just a normal weekday. I mean, it's always nice to have a company, you know? <laughs> the temple we visited today is called Iwayaji. The road we were walking now is actually a back street, but a lot of Ohendo-san prefer this route rather than the main path because the back street is well paved and much easier to walk. So that being said, this might look like a main gate, but this is actually a back gate of the temple. Ohendo was chosen to be one of the 52 places to go in 2015 on New York Times, and they took the picture right here. That was actually really cool. Yeah? It gets you thinking more than you would think because the stairs are really narrow and they're covered in moss, so it's kind of slippery. So you've got to take care in each step. You can't just like walk the stairs like normal stairs. So it becomes like kind of a meditative moment as you're focusing on each step in this narrow little stairway. And just after doing one, you're kind of like, okay, I understand why you do this a hundred times. I'll just remember. Spider. I'll just remember that I went by once. Yeah, we don't need those counters. Oh god! Oh god! Oh god! Oh god. I've never seen it like this. Anyway, you gotta accept the fact that the giant spider is also a part of the nature, and let's keep going. To get to the temple shouldn't have taken us so much time, but we couldn't help taking photos and videos because the mountain is just so amazing and almost breathtaking. And also you learn some interesting facts too. Finally, we are at Iwayaji. Iwa means rock in Japanese, and this temple literally stands in front of the enormous rock. the main gate. Now you can see how hard it will be to come down this path, right? After 
after the pilgrimage, we headed to Mount Isuzuchi, which is the tallest mountain in western Japan. It's such a hassle to climb the mountain, so we didn't do that this time. But instead, we got a chance to attend the formal Shinto ceremony at the Ishizuchi Shrine. Like the cutest looking ones are for a safe pregnancy. Safe pregnancy. <laughs> and I'm like, I don't need that one. <laughs> They're like, oh no, get it now for the future. There was an array of charms for your own good and badges to support Mount Ishizuchi. No, no, no. My first. And then, like, I have never tried it, and I'm like, I'm like only Japanese here. And then, like, if I screwed it up, like, we believe in you. We believe in you. Thank 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 you. Thank
Yamazaki, we visited Yamatoya Honten to see some dogo art. At the station called Moroeki, there's a raccoon station master since they used to have an action.